uh, Bucks Uni say just to do their pre-season testing. So we're just looking at their strength, flexibility, their sort of body composition, and then also their movement control. And the idea of that is it just gives us an indication of where they're at after obviously their summer break and sort of areas for improvement and how sort of we can avoid injuries in the season. The bod pod uh, looks quite a frightening contraction. What goes on in there? Yeah, so it's basically a, a way of measuring their body fat percentage. So it's, it's the one that they, they least look forward to, especially those that have had better summers than the others. Um, yeah, it just gives us an idea of where they're at and sort of we tend to try and do that again throughout the season just to make sure that they're on track with sort of their measurements. At this time of year, medical staff aren't normally too popular with the players. You're putting them through their paces, but it's a good spirit, isn't it? Good to see the boys back in there. They all seem to be enjoying catching up. Yeah, you can obviously see that they're all buzzing to see each other again. Obviously, haven't seen each other in a while. Um, but yeah, we're probably it's, it's probably half of them with their best friends because some of them need a bit of work um, after after the summer, and then some of us hate them because we're kind of chasing them, trying to get them to do extras and things like that. So yeah, it's a real mixture. And a great relationship the club has with the university and the students benefit, I suppose, uh, not just today but all through last season, through the forthcoming season, hands-on experience with professional footballers. Yeah, so it's, it's a big thanks to Bucks Uni really. So. Um, yeah, it's great to have the students down here helping, it's great for them obviously for their development just to see what happens in sort of a professional environment and it's great for us to have, have sort of hands on deck to help out with, with the extra bits that, you know, without them we, we, we might struggle a little bit.